Hey, what's going on guys? Nick here again from Smack Rock. And today I have something quite a bit different from, for you guys. Um, let's turn down some of this. It's still pretty loud. Let's, let's do... 30%. Eh, eh, there we go. Oh, 31. Alright, good enough. Alright, so uh, basically what we have here is uh, Castle Story. And basically what Castle Story is... Um, it's basically a tower defense, as you can see, uh, this is our crystal, and basically the whole point of this game is to protect this crystal from, uh, monsters that appear every 15 minutes, I think, as you can see up here, it's counting down, and, um, uh, we, as you can see, wave one starts in 14 minutes. Um, you start off with one, two, three, four workers, and one, um, warrior. Basically, these are your workers, and what they do is they collect your your materials. They they build for you, um, and that's basically all they do. They work. So, um, basic controls: W A S D. So A D S W to go forward, Q to rotate, E to rotate the other way. Uh, you can also use your middle mouse click, but it's really like clunky. Um, and it's kind of fast, so, uh, you can do that. Uh, so basically, let's, let's get this guy to work. So as you can see, we have a, a pickaxe over here. So if you click on this guy, and right-click on that, you can see he's going right over there, and he's going to go mine. But, uh, let's add two guys over there. So, uh, once he comes out, you're going to see what he comes out with. He comes out with a little bag, if you can see. He has 20 resources. And since he doesn't have anywhere to put it, he's just going to hold on to it. So what you're going to do is hold right click and drag down. And you have these options. you got place block, lumber task, place structure, or cleaning task. What we're going to do is go to place structure. And we're going to get this uh, stockpile. So basically, um, you, can, you can place this anywhere. So um, we're just going to place a few here. Um, we need to, yeah, rotate like that. Uh, and then if you want to get rid of it, you just shift click it and it gets rid of it. So let's just put these down like so. And, uh, they're still not going to do anything because, uh, you need wood to create it because it's a, a wooden structure. So what we're going to do is, let's rotate it and it's inverted. So what we're going to do is do the same right click thing again. We'll go to the lumber task and place it here. Um, and do the same thing. Click on a guy and right click. And uh, let's, let's put that guy there too. And what he's going to do is gonna, he's going to start chopping trees. And then uh, if they don't roll off the edge, because this is an island. Uh, Alright, cool. A few didn't, uh, none fell yet, but these are probably going to fall. So after they, yeah, all of them fell. <laughs> so what they're going to do is uh, they're going to get the wood and then... Uh, I gotta click on them, and then right click here, and they're gonna start building the uh, the stockpiles. So now these guys are gonna be like, sweet, we got a place to put our stuff, and um, uh, they start putting their materials, and that's basically how it goes. Um, then you can move these and put it here, and just keep on working. Now, uh, to start building. Um, like I said, the whole entire point of this game is to protect your, protect your crystal and survive as many waves as possible. So what you want, what you want to do is uh, make a nice base, obviously. So what we're going to do is uh, go to our place structures and go to a door. And um, since this is only like a, a first like playthrough, or not playthrough, a, a first look, um, we're just going to do a very simple, um, very simple thing. Uh, as you can see, as soon as you start placing things that require stone, they're going to go over there. And, um, uh, I think it's here? No. Here. Um, like I said, they're going to, excuse me, they're going to start placing the blocks as soon as they recognize they can place a block there. So, uh, what I'm doing now is basically just, um, placing the, um, the template of where I want all the blocks to be and 
as soon as uh, let's let's add this guy here and um, we need more wood where did and oh okay if you need more workers or another um, another defender you can hold right click on this and you can spawn a warrior which is this guy an archer which is obviously an archer or another worker um, since we're only on wave one I'm just gonna spawn another worker and he just plops up and we're gonna have this guy uh, cut down some more trees um, and now let's start uh, placing some more uh, blocks um, I actually saw this game at PAX East this year and um, it was um, oops. It was actually a really cool game. It's still in early access, and uh, it's really telling for 20 bucks now. It was on sale because I guess they were promoting it for packs, and um, yeah, it's uh, really fun. Uh, the only thing that I uh, do have to say is that the AI is a l is very clunky since obviously it's still in beta or early access, not even beta, and. Um, uh it's obviously something that they have to uh to like work on so you can't blame them um it's a good game uh nonetheless so whoops and um sometimes you you skip you can either right click or uh, shift click it to get rid of it or just put in oh, like that uh you can just stop doing that uh you can just put in a uh, a single block all right, almost done here. I'm just gonna get this uh, last row in, just like that, and like that. So now we got um, a normal cube just to protect us for right now. Um, okay, so now we're gonna have this guy. We don't need two builders right now. Come here and no, get this wood. Get that wood. No, come here. And you can you can move them. No, I don't want you to continue to build. I want you to build more stockpiles. Um. All right, we're just gonna have you do that. And that's pretty much the gist of this game. Um. Uh. You can have them mine uh, each individual block. Um. Say that you don't have a a mine nearby, they can drill right through a mountain and have a little uh, tunnel through a mountain to get to the other side. Um, a cleanup crew. Um, say there's a bunch of stuff on the ground, you can have them just. Uh, let's go over here. Start making that stuff. Uh, you can have them clean up and all that stuff. So. Um, for more structures, there's ladders. Um, catapults, which require wood, and, uh, the stone, the door, uh, a torch, which requires, uh, um, stone, and I think, a, a specific orange ore, the stockpile, a lantern, which is basically the same thing, but you can place it on the floor, and barrels for the catapult, which require a bunch of ores, and it launches things, so. Um, I want you... What are you doing? I want you stop doing that. Where'd you go? Start. There we go. Um, but yeah, like I said, the AI is a little weird sometimes, and it gets buggy. And also, if you right-click and hold the um, the crystal, it shows you uh, the percentage that they're ready to spawn at. And um, down here, once uh. The wave starts, you can recall your workers and they'll get right inside. They'll drop everything that they're, that they're doing and go right to the crystal to be safe because the workers are very weak and they get uh, one shot in. So, um, let's see. There's also, what else can we build here? There's the, the arches for the doors, the, the, the standard brick, the half brick. Uh, there's stairs because once, um, they start reaching uh, too tall. Um, what's it called? 
two-story buildings, they uh, they can't do anything. So you have to create stairs for them, and basically that's how you do it. Um, you got columns and planks. Basi basically, you need to put to place your planks. You need uh, columns, which is your scaffolding, where you can make an entire floor out of it. But basically, um, you just put down uh, some columns. And I think, I'm pretty sure that the, yeah, they have to be, like, next to a solid block. And, I don't know. I guess I can't place that one there. Uh, let's see if I can, I really like things even, but I'm really OCD about that. And, let's just do that. Uh, so basically these guys are mine, you see how the, it's a different ore? and um, they're placing all their blocks and um, they're uh, they're basically just doing their uh, they're doing their thing they're working and uh, yeah doing what they gotta do and that's pretty much the gist of this game um, it's pretty simple to uh, to get a grasp of um, three minutes and the next wave comes um, I, I can probably cut out, cut the video here, and uh, come back once uh, the next wave comes. Um, so, uh, they're building this. Uh, they're... Can I spawn another worker? No. Uh, what is this guy doing? He's building. Let's cut down some trees. Okay, get some wood going. So, uh, I'm going to cut the video here, and I'll be back with you guys once uh, the next wave, or the first wave, begins. Alright, so um, we got 10 seconds until they start coming, and basically I got all my workers just doing what they can to uh, build up this wall, um, because otherwise they're just gonna walk right over and, um, and, and yeah. Um, honestly, I don't even know, do they even, where are they? They didn't, the first wave didn't even come weird. Oh, here they come. Yep, here they come. Uh, any, any come from over here? There's only two enemies, as you can see, from enemy and and what I have. So, we're just gonna um, have my archer go over here and start pelting him. Oh. No. And, yeah, as you can see, the archer is very weak and uh, die very easily. And the warrior can take a little bit of damage. And that was the first wave. Um, they slowly regen. So I lost a. I should have kept the, the archer there. I don't know why I did that. But um, I guess it was good because I showed you how uh, how much damage they take and all that good stuff. So. Um, yeah, okay. Um. And see, this is what I was talking about. How the the AI is uh, pretty uh, pretty clunky. Um, once they get in each other's way, like they really okay, there it goes. But uh, once they get in their way, they get really um, uh, they really don't know what they're doing, so they just completely just sit there. So uh, yeah, like I said, this game is still in beta or early access. I keep saying uh, beta. Um, so, uh, if you want them to, uh, keep, uh, producing this game and doing updates, I'd highly recommend, uh, buying, buying this game. Like I said, it's only $20. Um, definitely, definitely worth getting. Um, very fun and, um, could definitely get a lot better. Um, see, this guy is just sitting here. Um, Okay. There we go. Alright. And I think that is basically it. Um, I guess I'll show you the cleaning task. See these guys? See all this stuff? We'll just have this guy go here and pick up all this stuff. And everything just starts uh, going right into his bag. Um, it has a pretty pretty large radius. So if you got a bunch of stuff scattered everywhere, uh, this is a pretty cool tool. And that is it um, so far. Um, 
if you guys would like me to do a playthrough of this, um, I would definitely do it. Uh, this is a very fun game. Uh, on my, uh, before I recorded this, I got to uh, Wave 10 on my own world. So, uh, definitely a fun game. I definitely recommend checking it out. And um, that is uh, pretty much it. So, uh, if you guys want some more, make sure you leave a like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. And um, we'll see you in the next video. Later.